is George Allen here, Feel Good Bicycles, and I'm going to start a new little series here for every month. We're going to do a wee video showing what's happening in the shop, anything cool, anything new and exciting, or anything that's going on in the biking world in general. We need to come up with a name, so if you've got a good name for this monthly series, drop them in the comments below. So the first thing I'm going to do is announce one of our new ambassadors. We're going to have a few this year. And the first of them that we're going to add is Jamie Callahan. You may have seen him on our Instagram channel. We've been pushing up on the Friday Fives. He is going to be riding a Nuke Proof for us this year. Nuke Proof is one of our new brands. He actually got the first frame in. Check this out. We did a sweet build. He's got the Nuke Proof Giga. He's running it as a mullet with a 29er in the front and 27.5 in the rear. He's got a 170 in the fork. Zebs on the front and the EXT coil. Finish out the build, some lovely little components, Axis drivetrain, Axis seat post. So he's only got the two brake cables basically, lovely and clean, absolutely beautiful build. Looking forward to seeing how well he does this season on it. He is a fast rider, so keep an eye on him for the year on the enduro and the downhill races. Next thing we want to talk about, I want to do a bike check on the Giant Rain one that we have here in the shop. The rain bikes in the past, they've kind of suffered from maybe a little bit of a lack of travel in the rear particularly, where they didn't quite have as much as your other brands. I'm trying to fix this this year with the 2023 range of the rain and they look absolutely class. Let's check out the bike. So this is the giant rain one 2023 model, the new one. And as I was saying that Giant in the past, they haven't had a whole lot of rear travel, but they've fixed that here with a full 160 of rear travel on this bike. 170 mil travel forks on it on all the models, except for the SX, which actually comes with a Fox 40 on the front and 165 mil rear travel. This model here, the Rain 1, I think they've knocked it out of the park with this one. First of all, the color is amazing. All the models come with frame storage and You've got a flip chip in the rear that's hidden under here, very easy to change. You can run it in three different geometry settings, which is really cool. You can run these as a mullet as well. I don't know if I mentioned that already. So really versatile, and I imagine to be great riding bikes. I haven't actually tried one yet, and I'm keen to do so because Giant have always made great riding bikes. Sometimes they just haven't been as sexy as other brands, but this one, this one is. Price point wise, the Rain 1 here in the aluminium is only €4,599. But for that, you're getting Fox 38 with the Grip 2 damper in it and a Florex 2 on the rear, which has the compression and rebound adjustment. If you have a look across a lot of the other brands out there, you don't get that sort of spec for that sort of money. So really, really well priced. Sensibly length 170 mil cranks, SLX drivetrain, just perfect, bomb proof and solid. Tires wise, out of the box actually comes with an EXO Plus casing at the front and a double down on the rear. A whole different range of options in the range. There's good availability on them. You've got carbon models and aluminium models. Get in touch if you'd like to find out a bit more. I think this is going to be a really, really good bike for this year. Next bit of news is the hire bike. We are doing e-bikes for hire you can do short-term rentals long-term rentals by the time this video is live we should be either very soon or have a online booking system for that so if you want to try an e-bike you can just try one for free here you don't just take it for a spin but if you want to take one for a few days or even for a month and actually have a go and see what they're like in real use for commuting get in touch and try them out Another exciting thing for the shop and probably more exciting for me, my new race bike this year and our new brand is Deviate. This is my new Deviate Claymore frame. It's literally just arrived. I'll get it built up next week and we'll go and do a bit of a deep dive on that. But if you're familiar with Deviate or not, you might have heard of Matthew Fairbrother, a very young EWS rider. He cycled to each of the enduro events last year on his Claymore and competed and did pretty well actually as well. So uh, super exciting to watch him as he comes along. But that brought Deviate uh, 
along quite a lot last year. They used to do a gearbox bike, which is called the Guide, which I saw first a good few years ago, was quite intrigued by and wanted to try. And they've been doing high pivots since about 2016, so they should be pretty good at it by now. I've never ridden a high pivot bike. Can't wait to try it and see what it feels like. It's got excellent reviews in the pink bike field test and all three testers chose it as their favorite bike, whether it's for all around uh, use and for a race machine as well. So I think it's going to be good. I'm looking forward to it. So check back next month where we'll have a proper in-depth video, a bit of riding footage, and I can tell you really what it's like. And lastly, with the news is the other thing with hire, we've got our bike bags for hire. So if you're going away this uh, season, or you've got a trip planned, and you want to pack up your bike and send and bring it with you, we've got these really good Evoc bags. Have a look at them here. We're going to have an online booking portal for those as well. We already have a few bookings already, so get your dates in if you've got them already. You can book me in as well. I fit in a bag, so yeah, I'll come too. So we're going to try to keep this video short enough. We'll deep dive in a little bit more in our next video when I've got some more things to show you.